If you are researching electric pool heaters looking for an option for heating your pool water, you should be aware that electric heat is the most inefficient way to heat a swimming pool of all the options available to you. Now that's assuming we're talking about an electric heat element like you would find in a hot tub for example. There is however another option for swimming pools uh, where you use electricity and that would be with an electric heat pump. An electric heat pump basically works like a reverse air conditioner and it uses ambient air temperature to warm the swimming pool. Now the performance of an electric heat pump might be more closely similar to a solar heater than it would be to a gas heater. The electric pool pump or electric heat pump requires hot and sunny weather as well as nighttime temperatures that don't dip too low in, or in order to maintain your swimming pool temperature. It's not like a gas heater where you simply feed money into it and it makes your pool hot any time of year. An electric heat pump is only useful for certain times of the year and only useful in certain climates. But if it is, uh, if you live in an area where you get a lot of sun and it's very warm and your electricity costs aren't super expensive, then you will probably find that an electric heat pump is one of the most efficient ways that you can possibly heat your water as compared to the just electric uh, heat as a result of a heating element. That is the most inefficient way that you can possibly heat a pool and really wouldn't be suitable for anything larger than a large hot tub. If you found this information helpful, please like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can also check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.